Hey, what's up guys? Alex here with a tutorial on how to do the shutter effect in Sony Vegas Pro 10. You can also do this in Sony Vegas Pro 8, 9, and Movie Studio Platinum. So if you look at this video, this is what, basically what we're going to be learning how to do today. And it's basically cutting parts of the footage out so that it kind of gives it that uh, synchronization with the music you're putting along with your video. So if you go into Sony Vegas, uh, you have your music sample. I have mine right here. And I'm going to be using the snare, the snares to sync my footage along with my music. Uh, normally people use the um, drums in the song to sync it, but uh, you can also use claps, snares, and of course drums. So when you put your footage in, you just want to cut any random footage, it doesn't really matter. And we're going to be learning how to do use the marker tool in Sony Vegas. So if you click on our video and press M, marker will show up. And these will tell you where to cut on, um, at what point to cut your footage. And we're just going to drop this down. And that will decrease the speed of the entire video. So if you play it, it's slowing down. So I'm just going to decrease it more. And every time you hear a drum clap or snare, you want to press M. And what that's going to do is place a marker on that exact point and that allows you to cut it so let's um, play it and place the markers along the footage so that's basically what it looks like after you're done Let's right click this and set it to 1. That's the regular speed. And um, so we're halfway done. And what we're going to do is about 1 to 2 frames on each side of the marker, you want to cut your footage out. So if you go back to the beginning and play it, that's going to kind of give it the black flash look. And you can't have anything under this video track right here or else, um, for example, if I place this immediate generator, it's going to look like this. And you don't want anything under your video track. Now let's do this for the rest of the 17 markers we have here. Delete it. And since I'm really lazy, I'm not going to do it for the rest of the markers. Now let's preview this and see how it looks. And if you look at the screen, and that's how you do the shutter effect in Sony Vegas. Now, if this tutorial helped you, uh, just comment on this video, give it a like. Um, and if you have any more tutorial requests, just send me a message. And I will see you guys next time.